What up? It's your boy DJPK, and we are back with another Christmas themed 15 first. And I would like to introduce you to Gremlins Gizmo for the Wii. You may have forgotten that this is technically a Christmas movie. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and transition. Mm, there we go. All right, here we go. Gremlins Gizmo. <laughs> I didn't even know this existed. See, this is the fun thing about like having to search for like specific themed games is you you really do learn about games you've never even heard of. And the the challenge to play games that you've never you would I would have never played this had I not been searching for uh freaking Oh you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, no, I'll continue without saving. Yeah, um I I would if if I wasn't doing fifteen first <laughs> looking for Christmas games, never ever would have played this ever. <laughs> It's a little creepy. Press the A button. Okay. Little Christmas nunchucks going on here. Nunchucky. I guess. I don't know. There he goes again. <laughs> Is he going to pop up every time I like transition? No, there he goes. Can I grab him? No. Okay, let's start game, help options, awards, exit, game start. Oh, you can choose different. Uh, crap, what the? Mogwai? Mogwai? Is that what they're called? Grace, Daffy, Valerie, and Lenny. I'm pretty sure that none of these are actually canon. <laughs> I, I, actually, I don't know. Did his the babies have names i think they're technically babies i mean he he buds like a sponge <laughs> i don't know anyways oh here let me kick that that sweet sweet countdown timer there we go get that 15 minutes going mm. you got bedroom attic living room garage backyard and clubhouse bedroom it is I'm gonna look at that pinwheel. It's a pretty sick loading screen. Hi, Lenny. How was school? A package arrived for you today. I have no idea what it is, though. Point at the box and press A. This is triggering. Why are there already gremlins? That doesn't even make sense. So we had a gremlin problem before our new Mogwai. Expel the gremlins. Got you, sucker. I didn't want. I didn't mean to click that. I was trying to get that that sucker over here. I'm not gonna lie, his character design is terrible. <laughs> to move your cursor in front of the ball and catch it. This is insane. <laughs> what is this? Come on. This is ridiculous.
Now, I'm going to be really angry if this lasts more than 10 tries. <laughs> I'm just saying. Because this is stupid. <laughs> this, like, this could be a fun game mechanic um, if it wasn't so dreadfully boring. You win. Do you wish to play again? No. <laughs> no, I don't. Uh, I got new costumes. Okay. <laughs> what is this? Is this like Pokemon Pikachu or something? Trike Trounce. How to play. Shoot all the gremlins without running into them. Okay. Use Perse to shoot at the enemies. Oh my gosh. This is asteroids? Literally? You're giving me asteroids on the Wii. This is 100% asteroids. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, their hitbox is massive, because I'm pretty sure I did not touch them. Like, I, I know I got really close, but I'm pretty sure I didn't touch them. You little buttheads. Did not realize, um, uh, <laughs> I did not realize that, uh, there was going to be an, an art Atari game on here. <laughs> like, what the crap? This is absurd. <laughs> this is really absurd. Now, I'm not crapping on Atari games. I, they have a very special place in my heart. I, I do like... There are several different, very entertaining Atari games. Um, I do like Asteroid. As you can see, I'm actually, I would say, pretty good at it. I, though I did die a couple of times, but... It handle, it's The sensitivity is a little higher than on uh, Asteroid. On Asteroid, like, your propulsion actually takes quite a bit of time to get up to speed. Um... And, uh, the sensitivity, like, if I recall correctly, on Asteroid, you could spin a lot easier without moving. On here, I tend to move a lot while I'm just trying to spin around and shoot, shoot enemies, so, no. But, I, what I am crapping on is, like, if this seems to be the entire game, I was hoping for more. I was hoping that... I was hoping that... It would be more of like an adventure game or something, but... It's literally like... Him playing a bunch of these kind of like lame mini-games. <laughs>
guess. No. Why? Why is this a thing? <laughs> Why is... Okay. Well, apparently, that's... Those games are locked. This is locked. The balloon's locked. No, he doesn't get any points. Okay. What are we going to do? Dress up now? So he got points for hugging it. Uh-oh, the gremlins are scaring your mogwai friends. Select the places you think... Okay, so... So it's happening again? the hmm without crashing to, into any other trains oh pick up the hmm I'm going to crash right into him. I don't I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, I can hold down? Can I, like, turn? No? Oh, poopins. Thank you. Thank you. Please be finished. No. Gosh. I've got more costumes out here. Let's go check the, the closet. Oh my gosh. The freaking... 
The voice acting for him is terrible. It sounded like they did, like, the recording for him, like, in the bathroom. Just, like, it's, it's, it literally sounds like they're coming from, like, one side of the microphone. It's awful. No, no, don't get this taken off. It's probably copyrighted. <laughs> like, get out of here. Playing that freaking music. <laughs> yes, we're keeping the frog one. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> what? I thought that was the shape. Oh, I'm stupid. I, I. I, I thought it was, like, reversed. I, I should be smarter than to think that they would flip it. It's considering that these... This stuff is dreadfully boring and easy. Like, literally, this game is pattern recognition. Like... I can't believe this. this I, I, clearly, this was designed for children, but strangely, they chose to like. I I, I don't get it. Actually, <laughs> I really don't get it. I don't know why they chose to um, release this as a, a Gremlins game. Because, like, I don't really. Only parents, only the parents would would be like, oh, Gremlins, oh, yeah, yeah, I remember that. It's nostalgic. I'll, I'll get it for my kids. I mean, I guess that's the only way you're going to get this. Because I don't think any children at this time would have even known what Gremlins was. Cannot believe this. Cannot believe this. Get out of my face. Are they even repeating constellations? I am glad that the time is up. This is bananas, guys. Um... Do I have to, like, make a mistake for this to stop? Oh my gosh, there's a timer? You've got to be kidding me. Dear heavens. Um, okay. 
let's get to the ratings of this game. So the graphics, I think, are great. They look very fun. Um, the motion controls are are good. Sometimes you've got motion controls that are, that are just like incredibly like hypersensitive, and it actually makes it really difficult. Um, I'm looking at you, uh, Silent Hill, for the the uh, the Wii, the flashlight was going all over the place, and that one, and that I I really wasn't feeling that too much, but this one it's really solid. The sensitivity is good. Um, the sound effects are pretty good, though. Um, when it comes to the most important part, though, the main character. Gizmo is awful. Gizmo is is terrible. He 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 sounds like he's coming out the side of the the microphone. And uh yeah. I mean, he doesn't sound like overly terrible, but it it doesn't sound it doesn't sound well recorded. Um Oh my gosh. It keeps on refilling. Oh, get out of here. No. No. Nope. I'm done. I'm going to let that I'm going to let the tries. Does this honestly keep on going until <laughs> Okay. I'm going to go ahead and yeah, I think it honestly keeps on going through these same uh constellations until you get a game over. Which apparently doesn't seem to ever happen because the timer keeps on refilling. Um, now, as for gameplay, this gets a one, a one star. Um, it's so simplistic and boring. Um, they literally have not created anything unique here. I mean, the one... Th the one thing that's really, like, a game at all is Asteroid for the Atari. Like, <laughs> I, I really feel like they didn't try to be creative at all. <laughs> I'm going to let it run down, sorry. Yeah, this is ridiculous. These games, okay... Clearly, this was developed for children. There's no way that they did this for an adult. Now, I could say for a young child that this is simple enough for them to play, and maybe they'd have fun with it. So d try try this with kids. Try this with kids. Uh, as an adult, this is not fun. It is not. It is not an entertaining game at all. Apparently, we've got the attic unlocked I think my daughter might enjoy this game because it's got little cute characters and little monsters and she's she likes that kind of stuff that being said though um I think some of this stuff would be a little difficult for her. Um, okay, now I'm Grace, apparently. But I think I think uh, for the the scale, my daughter my daughter's still a little too small. Maybe she could probably do it, but she might get frustrated with. Having to <laughs> um, see, okay, yeah, this is definitely made for children, and I could see them ha being able to have fun with this. There are certain things that I think that they would like to do more than um, than others, definitely though. So I can appreciate that. I feel like they've. They're a bit misguided on the front of choosing Gremlins because I don't I don't think there was even a movie out at the time. 
Transition. Oh, that put me to sleep. Mm. But, <laughs> but, uh, for kids, I would say this is a solid three out of five stars for kids. Um, I think it seems safe and there's a lot of different things for them to do that kids like, like coloring pictures and doing little simple races and uh, playing with ha having cute little cuddly guys hug, hug little teddy bears and stuff. That's very, uh, very appealing to kids, I think. Um, though I'm not willing to give it more uh, because I think um, they could have... They could have tried to do this with a character that was more popular with children. I, I um, like Winnie the Pooh or Mickey Mouse or something. Like I, don't, I really don't understand why they tried to go with the Gremlin franchise. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, and again, the games are a bit like they lack creativity. Like, all of this is, like, stuff that we've seen ages ago. Like, the whole, like, fill in the, like, the, the paint by color thing and stuff like that. That's not, that's not new, like, that's not, uh, what, what's the word? Like, breaking, uh, I can't even remember what, <laughs> it's, it's not, like, um, new technology. Like, we're, <laughs> it's literally... Um, something that's been out for a really, 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 really long time. Again, as well as, uh, as Asteroids. So, yeah, that's why I'm only giving them a 3 out of 5. But, um, it would be great to let your children play, so. And that could be a fun, a little, uh, Christmas, uh, Christmas time to spend with your children. Maybe you want to play a, a game with your little buddy. Uh, well, here you've got one, and you can have fun doing it together. All right, if you got any recommendations, I desperately need them. <laughs> As you can see, I'm grasping at straws with gremlins. Um, this is actually harder than it looks, to be honest. Uh, but yeah, if you got any recommendations, please leave them in the comment section below. Uh, if you like what I do, if you like what I do, give me a like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> And as always, love, peace, Afro-Grease, and Merry Christmas, I'm out of here.